Hi y'all, it's me. I'm back with another video. Oh my gosh, I have so many to catch up on. It's crazy. Okay, as you can see in this title of this video, I have to blame anybody but myself for what I did. <laughs> because, um, okay, I, you know, let me just start. I went to a, a Teresa Collins class and first of all, I blame the scrap store because it was so far from my house. That's number one. And then number two, that scrap store happens to be in the area where there are stores that I don't have access close enough by me here where I live. So that's another thing to blame. Number other, th well, I don't know what number, but anyway, another thing to blame is Rena, scrap stress, Rini, because we were supposed to meet before the class to hang out. And instead, since she didn't show up because she had to work, I was on my own. That's another thing. Next. Tamika, Scrap the World, she showed a paper pad on her video and I had to hunt it down. Okay, so with all that out of the way <laughs> and that I blamed everyone except myself and my credit card for being in my hand, um, <laughs> I was a bad girl. I got to the store early because I didn't want to get traffic, so I was bored. What do I do? Well, okay, I discovered on the way there, there was a Hobby Lobby. Yay! Don't get to go to those too often decided to swing in and see if by chance maybe they had this paper pad that Tamika had. So walk in, they don't have it. I'm bummed, right? So I'm walking down the aisle and ta-da! They had it in a 12 by 12 and I am so stinking excited. I love this paper. Okay, this is called Bramble Rose by my mind's eye. She said she got hers at Michael's, which she did because I'll tell you why later. But anyhow, um, they're different at Michael's than the, than this one. At least the 12 by 12. I didn't see it um, at Michael's. So anyway, this is the, it, oh, if you're into shabby and chevron, this is the one for you. Okay, granted, these are not th thick papers because they're, um, you know, they're in a stack like this, but you get uh, 180 sheets in here. And not only is it chevron mixed in with beautiful shabbiness, but oh my goodness gracious. I just fell in love with this stack when Tamika had it. And I had a 40% coupon, so I got to use that, thank goodness, because it wasn't on sale. But I'm just kind of flipping through kind of quickly because it's a big stack and I really want to get, I have a lot to show you, lots, 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 lots. So let me keep going here really fast. Oh, it's just lovely, you guys. If you're into shabby, this is the one. If you love chevrons, this is the one. There's just so much stuff in here. It's lovely. Um, I'm actually making some projects with it as we speak. So anyway, that's it. It's called Bramble Rose. So while I was there, I promised to be good. And I said, well, I'm only going to go in for what I went for. But then I was walking around and I saw that these were there for 40% um, off for $4.99, which was a great deal. And I love that pattern. So I went ahead and picked up the embossing folder and a black pen. That's the only things I got there. So I wasn't doing too bad at that point. Then I have some time to spare. So I'm going, okay, where can I go now? Well, the next store that was not too far from where I was going happened to be Daiso. Oh my gosh, I've never been to Daiso. I'm worried about Daiso because I found out while I was at that Daiso that there's one just seven minutes away from my house that just opened. And I'm going to go wacky crazy there. Um, <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm just going to start showing you the things I got there. I don't know how else to do this. Here, let me start with what I saw when I walked in the front door. I saw these at Daiso. Aren't these lovely? $1.50, guys. Come on. <laughs> so I got white or off-white, baby blue, and a pink. These are going to be desk accessories to hold things on my desk. And I also got in the same line, these two things, which I thought were great for pencil holders and whatnot. Really cute, $1.50 guys, okay? Then I found this, which it's kind of similar, the same coloring as the roses, just doesn't have the bling on it, but $1.50. And this, which is a mirror. And it was also $1.50, and it has an easel stand so you can stand it up. And last but not least in this category, 
I found this little pretty little dish and I loved it. It has little hearts on it and I love Valentine's Day and I just thought it would make a cute little bowl to hold buttons or something like that. Okay, this is Daiso, mind you. So, that was one of the first things I got there. That was what I saw when I walked right in the door. Let me move them out of the way. Next, I found this plastic um, storage container, which it's really nice. It's got a nice handle on it. Good size for paint brushes or whatever long items you might have. I'm just going to start pulling stuff out the bag. This is origami paper, and this one is all gingham in different colors. There's like four or five colors in there. And this one's all rose pattern in different colors. Many different different sets in there. So, 100 sheets, $1.50. Got that. I found some small clips. And they're nice because they're not too small. I found these cute little treat bags. Little roses on them. I found these clear... Um, pockets for cards and whatnot and they had oh so many sizes <laughs> just the ones I picked up they had double sided adhesive and this one seems to be about a quarter inch and this one about a half an inch so I wanted to try them and so I picked up several in case I really like it I thought I was going to have to travel far to find it again but like I said, there's one seven minutes from me now. I'm in trouble. <laughs> so next, I found this little um, wallet to hold, um, you know, your driver's license, pictures, whatever. I thought it was cute, so I picked that up. I got two packages of those, really cute, for Valentine's Day. I found this little container of washi tape and it has the little dispenser right there and then the different washi tapes. Really cute. $1.50 everything so far. I got this ribbon which was $1.50 and it's two separate ribbons, not one. You get uh, quite a bit in there. I don't know, I can't, I don't know how many yards but. And then lastly, I think, no, I think I got other stuff because I got stuff in my kitchen. Um, they have lots of kitchen stuff in there. Oh, and I got this, which is an eyeglass holder, which I thought was so cute. It's so shabby chic and it's pink. And so I get that. And then they had this trim and it's beaded and it's really thin and it's very pretty. And you get, I don't know, a whole bunch on here. And so I picked them up in Valentine colors. Um, I think for Daiso, that was it. Pretty sure. Okay, next. I'm going to get this stuff out. Sorry. I'm trying to do this the best way I can, but you know how it is. Oh my gosh, that store, you guys, if you ever get a chance to go to a Daiso, oh, be prepared. You know, $1.50, $1.50, $1.50, $1.50 adds up really fast. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. <laughs> okay, so then, okay, so then I'm going and I'm like, oh, what am I going to do now? It's still too early. Class was far. Oh, and I could blame Teresa, too, for having the class so late. But anyhow, <laughs> um, okay, so then the next thing I passed by was Joanne's. And, <laughs> oh, God. Okay, I wasn't going to get anything at Joanne's because what I went in for they didn't have. But what they did have was this, which is older. I know it's the Antique Papery Collection. But it was $2.27 they were clearancing. And it was so funny because the guy goes, oh, finally somebody's buying that. We've been trying to get rid of it and nobody's buying it. I'm like, okay, well, I'll buy it. So um, I got that one. This one was $1.97, which it's the same paper. It's just in a smaller scale down uh, size and a few different sheets, actually. I got these uh, envelope pockets for $0.97. Cents. This was 97 cents. These were 97 cents. 97 cents for web bonds. Everything was 97 cents. Die cuts, 97 cents. More die cuts. Chipboard pieces, 97 cents. <laughs> and these are um, in belly words for 97 cents. So I don't know if I'll end up using these or using them for giveaways or what at my scrap room. 
haven't decided yet. Um, also was able to find these Valentine stamps. This one's cute, little heart banner, an arrow with a heart, February 14th, love potion, smitten, I love you, my love, love, and a little banner. Really cute. Really, really cute. Okay. That was Joanne's. Uh, sorry. Try not to let it all fall. Next, we have... I go to the store, and I said, okay, I'm done. I'm going to go sit at the store and wait. So I get to the store, start walking around. <laughs> oh, my God. It's a scrapbook store, mind you. So... They had the new Teresa Collins stuff out that's not out yet. It's being released at CHA today. But the store already had some. So I'm going to share with you just a little collection that I got. I didn't buy so much because we were taking a class anyway. Um, this is her new collection. It's called She Said. And He Said. He Said, She Said. Um, this is the she part because there's the he part. Also very cute. And, um, yeah, it's very Teresa and very cute. Very nice collection. <clears throat> so we were, <clears throat> excuse me, we were told we were the first ones to be able to purchase it. Because um, this store apparently was the first store to have it. So I picked up that, and I picked up this to go with it. These are file folders that match the she said portion of the he said, she said. And then, <clears throat> I'm sorry, my voice is cracking. Um, I got the the die cut sheet to go with it as well. Really cute collection. So I'm looking forward to making something with that part. And then <clears throat> she has another one out called Memories. She's got four actually. Um, a travel one that he says she said Memories and an office supply looking one. I forget the name of it. But anyhow, this is part of the Memories collection. And um, I just picked up some sheets. They didn't have the, the pads in. They didn't come in by the time of our class. So um, this is the die cut squares you can cut out. The back is lined. Sorry. Isn't this lovely? I love the colors of this one. Gray and the blue, the teal blues and stuff. It's so pretty. Um, this one. The doily one, really cute. And that's the back. This one has the days and months. Pretty cute. And that on the back. This is one of my favorite ones right here. I love this color. I said I want wallpaper like this. <laughs> I got two of those. And there. So, okay. Then I did that. So then I said, oh, I lied one more. <laughs> This is not a new release, but I wanted this one. This is her bingo stamp, Teresa Collins. And what I love about it is you can put any word you want in there that comes here. If you have a small um, stamp of your own, you can add your own thing. And it's got some other words and stuff here. So pretty cute. And I love that it's not huge because most of the bingo cards I've seen, they're pretty large. This one's smaller. Okay. So then... I went outside of the store, sat in my car a little while. I was bored, no one to talk to, nothing to do. I'm like, crud. And it was way earlier than the class, so um, <laughs> I, I go back and I say, excuse me, where is there something to do around here? She said, oh, Michael's is just quite a quarter of a mile up the street. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> okay, so I go to the there, and outside... They have their stamps, all their Christmas stuff still. Nobody's bought any of it. It's like they had tons. And this was, I think it came out to 97 cents, I think, is what they were selling for. They were trying to get rid of all this stuff. Now, this Michaels, I've never seen a Michaels so stocked in my life. This Michaels had all the $2 bin stuff in, all the $1.50 bin, all the dollar stuff. They were filled. They had everything. I've never seen anything like it. Um, so I stopped at the dollar fifty bin and I picked up these cards. I picked up 
get these from the dollar store. We did not too much actually. And I got these, which Friday had shown on her video, so I blame her too. <laughs> um, they're so cute. They're candy jars with little candies in them. And they're good sized, you know, they're not too small. So I got those. I finally found the boxes I wanted. Yay! <laughs> the really thing I wanted was this and this. Those were what I really was looking for. So I got um, those. Then I walked over by the $2.51 or the $2 one and I found these with canvas, which Lena says they're hot items. So <laughs> I got two of them. Um, then I picked up these two frames also in this color. And these flowers because I really like the color and I know this matches with the Teresa Collins really well and so um, last thing was I was walking around the store looking at the scrapbook section I knew I wasn't going to get any papers or stuff because I just already got everything turned my head and what do you know <laughs> I had the bramble rose and the small pad six by six so <laughs> of course I had to indulge and get another <laughs> and I didn't just get one I got two because that's how much I really love this collection and I'm already like I said using it on a project so um, and then last thing I'm showing you I think yes is this one I saw there too it's called love me and I just loved it so I went ahead and picked it up it's double-sided really cute so there you go that's my blame it on everyone else haul so um <laughs> thanks so much for sticking with me i know it was a long video but oh well you know it just went wacky i gotta knock it off <laughs> and i have more videos so i'll be back later have a great day bye <laughs>